Hello there, and welcome to The War Factory for today, September the 5th. Now, I got a plan, and I came in with a badass plan, and it's going to kick some butt. Unfortunately, my fingers do not agree with my plan. My plan was to drop everything under the smokes, aim them at those rocket launchers, throw some shock down, and let my Zookas just wail on those things uh, to kind of clear them out of the way. Well, obviously my smokes suck, and I unfortunately dumped a bunch of Zookas right into the path of an oncoming freight train, and they got splattered. So, okay, we made it through. We have a few Zookas left. My goal is to get them up to where the the flare is placed, and I anticipated, obviously, the completely wrong path. As you can see, I pretty much lose all the Zookas that I have left to... I don't, I don't even understand why they went over there. Uh, apparently, I need to sit back and do some research on Smoky Zooka pathing, because that was an utter nightmare. I I don't even understand how it happened. Now the good news is because we've already taken out the rocket launchers, it, at least the landing is a little bit easier this time through. Um, I can go up my up the shore without having to smoke or do anything until the very end where I can drop the smoke to keep all my Zookas safe from the sniper towers and the rocket launcher that is up there that I am going to head towards because I am sure that rocket launcher would love a taste of Zooka. Now also to be extra safe, this time I am placing my flare slightly differently to allow for any weird pathing and fortunately this time through it looks like I am getting everything into the right place and I get the majority of my troops up to where I want them. Now the beauty of this is this is a two shock clear everything out and as you can see um, I was a little late on the second shock but the four pack of lasers over to the like very north of the map um, are taken out, and then I can let my Zookas work on the rest of the defenses down here. Now, the only mistake I made here was pulling them away about two seconds too late. As you can see, those lasers just come up from behind without mercy and just absolutely shred my poor Zookas. So, second attack didn't quite go the way I had hoped, but at least I can dump the last of my energy and I've done some decent damage. Now, my third attack, I fully planned on this to be a GBE only attack. And unfortunately, um, I did a slight miscalculation. I fully expected my AoE damage from hitting that shock blaster to take out the damage amplifier allowing me that that magical amount of energy which I was then, you know, not given, unfortunately. Um, so I took out the rocket launcher. That was my real target of this attack. If you take out that one rocket launcher, it gives you a beautiful safe spot right near the health, uh, building health and damage statues. So I figured, okay, you know what? I, I can't just leave it with 11 energy. I need to make use of this energy. I'm just going to drop my Zookas long enough that I can get my artillery and then I'm going to make them run away. Well, like a nimcompoop, I unfortunately let them go a little longer than they should have. So once, once I got whacked by that laser, I was like, well, I'm going to have to refresh my troops. I might as well go out with a bang. And I basically let my ladies just run through this whole mess, doing as much damage as I possibly could, accepting the fact that I was going to get hammered repeatedly by those lasers, and eventually running away with next to no one there. Now, it's a massive failure as far as an attack, but the fact that it was supposed to be just a GBE attack, I feel like that makes it better somehow. 
Anyway, fourth attack, throwing a barrage to finish off the buildings up at the top because they're all so weak uh, that, you know, one barrage takes out three buildings. That's actually uh, almost a positive, you know, like it's a break even uh, at the very least. Now, I, I was aiming for my safe spot and unfortunately, as you can see here, my Zookas kind of rolled up a little too far and got into range of the laser beam. And then, once again, I mess up all of my freaking smokes, leaving a whole bunch of Zookas wide open for some serious laser blasting. Um, and I also kind of misplaced them because I let them just fan out as they would instead of flaring them together into a nice tight clump, which allowed the lasers in the north to join in. And then it didn't help that I had incredibly horrible placement on my critters, which actually drew laser fire to my Zookas in the smoke. I tell ya, it just like one failure after another. It's absolutely brutal. So I watched the last of my Zookas for attack number four go down. I cried a little bit and I came back fully stocked and ready to do some damage. And I'm thinking to myself, all right, I'm going to be extra smart. I am not going to go far enough north to let those lasers absolutely destroy me up there. This is going to be amazing. This is going to be perfect. I am going to do this. So I brought everything nice and far south, which, you know, seemed to be the surefire way to not have those lasers up in the north do horrible things. And I throw my shock onto the lasers in the south, and then I realize, oh, I am completely within range of those rocket launchers. And look at those rocket launchers go. Just absolutely shredding my troops. Brutal, absolutely brutal. So I pulled everything back, put them really where the troops should have been this entire freaking time, and then the true battle begins. The battle between my remaining Zookas, my remaining energy, and the HQ's remaining health. The good news is, I come out victorious by the skin of my teeth. That HQ goes down. And we get our loot. Anyways, guys, thanks very much for watching. Hopefully this has been helpful to show you no what not to do. Hopefully this has been entertaining. And most importantly, hopefully you guys have a fantastic day.